Hey there, welcome back to some more League of Legends with High Latency. This time, we're playing as Vi in the jungle yet again. So anyway, we're starting in red buff. So yeah, I really like this arcane skin, man. Like, I think Riot should do more of these. Like, just make uh, lore accurate skins or very cheap skins that just change or update the model by a little bit. Like, many people would buy this. Like, even though this arcane skin was mostly free, I think many people would buy this actually since uh, people really want lore accurate skins like example when there are skins for uh, moments where the Glock has a new comic or a new lore update I think it's if they really have a hard time in updating the base model why not create a very cheap skin like this the arcane skins that make it more lore accurate like they could have made uh, lore accurate skins for the comics from the Ash, Sejuani, and the Frailier people. Or when events happen, like for example, they I think they made the skin for Silas when it was released. So yeah, I think it's gonna be pretty. Ah, frick, she knows. So yeah, I think that's gonna be uh, like riot if you gather that idea please um i take no credit from that uh volibear are you trying to dive that guy please don't i am just farming here just ignore me maybe i can help this guy can i try to help him let's actually go never mind she went away okay let's try to gank top lane never mind she actually knows it's warded i really hit wards hmm it's really i really don't know what to talk about when you're when you're playing jungle since there are no and uh there are no happenings in lane maybe i can just talk about lanes or maybe more anecdotes what can i think about this time um yeah i was talking about the skins oh yeah speaking of skins there are people in um concerning why some of the characters in arcane didn't have skins like victor for example but maybe they're saving it for another season just maybe that's my thought on it or as well as echo as well as heimerdinger so maybe I think they're saving it for another skin line. Oh, and they are. My teammates are actually doing pretty well. So I have really no not much pressure since also the, the enemy jungler is not doing that much to uh, help their laners. So I think this is a win. So I can just wait for level 6 and just easy gank this. After I get level 6, I can probably easily gank a lane. Oh, a oh, freak. Um, there's something I can do here. Let's go. Do I live? Uh, I died. Hey, at least I got executed. Let's actually go. I think that was pretty worth execute for a free kill. Okay, let's see what's happening right here. Okay, Ezreal. Ooh, Ezreal with the Jukes though. I don't think they can win this. Oh wow, unless Ezreal hurts a lot. Oh wow! They actually turned it around? What the heck? Oh wow. And Ezreal still lives. Okay, never mind. Ezreal dies. But let's actually go. That was pretty sad though. But at least they got it in the end. Uh, be careful, Yasuo. There's a person behind you. I think I need to help him. Please don't die, my friend. Okay, he actually lives. Never mind. Let's try to help the top lane since he's really having trouble. But if I can just let him go late game, I think we can win this. Oh, so yeah, I really lost in thought there. I remember talking about skins in Arcane, like Heimer, Echo, and people like that. So I think the second season of Arcane will probably, here's my thoughts on it, um, Echo, obviously, Heimer, as well as, uh, let's try to defend this first, Victor. Victor, that's my thoughts on it. Okay, that's, okay, he's cleared. Oh, that well played, bot lane. The redemption arc. Let's go. Yasuo is doing pretty well. I'll defend mid lane. 
Let's try to defend mid lane. Let's go. Mid lane successfully defended. I don't have ultimate yet, but let's get dragon. I need help here, my good sirs. Okay, top lane is having a problem. But at least our other lanes are doing pretty well. Let's just get this. This is gonna be an easy get. Nice. Now let's try to help. Oh, let's go. What are you doing, my good sir? Are you just trying to die? Okay, let's try to help. Oh, wait, wait. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Don't die, don't die. Okay, nice. He missed. Let's go. Please don't die. You are so dead. Let's just, just block the view. And another one. Let's go. We're doing pretty well. Uh, I'm having a problem of top lane right now. But I think this is doing pretty well. Doing pretty well. So jungler, I think. A source dude, just trust me. And I look at there. Wait. Never mind. Ah. The freaking dude. Uh, what they call this? I think I just gonna have to defend this lane. I can't defend that, my man. Okay. Let's clear this. I'm dead. Am I dead? Oh wow, that actually hurts the lightning thing. I'm just gonna back away now since most likely he is going to dive me. I don't think I can do anything there my good sirs. Never mind. Not this bad. I think I'm just dead, right? <laughs> I think I just died. I didn't do anything. I should have just back. But wait. I think he can push this, right? Okay, Nasus. I remember this guy being in the top of the meta in the past because everybody just want uh, the meta in the past was just farming and farming. And with Nasus, you can infinitely stack your damage by just farming. So yeah, I really like how the meta involve and change every season. It just makes the game interesting as the game goes. And the, the longer you play, the more you realize how different the meta is in the past as compared in the present. Ah, uh, let's try to help you. Ah, frick. Let's try to do this. Ah, uh, you fool. Let's go. And the free shutdown gold baby let's, oh wow what the heck brand is on fire let's try to kill her corner that corner her let's go let's go well played now we get dragon okay this is a nice since we are targeting Aurelia Nasus can focus on farming and get really tanky as well as more damage the later this game goes. I mean, the longer this game goes. This is gonna be a nice game. This is a good thing since uh, Volibear is building AP, he is pretty squishy, so my allies can still do work to him even though uh, even though he hurts. Because originally, Volibear, he just hurt. Uh, he just is tanky as well as he hurts. But I really like the idea that he's going AP for us. So it's gonna be easier time for our team in general. And I can focus on being tanky. Since our team... Oh, see? See? I'm not even doing anything. My team's doing all the work. So I can focus on just supporting my team to victory. Okay. Back away. Back away. Back away. Not that way. Not that way. But wait unless... 
Haha, cowards. Uh, Samira, that's a bad place. I don't think that's a good idea. Let's just clear the waves and back off. Okay, that's actually though. They actually got it. Even though so much uh, the Baron is almost up. Let's try to get Ezreal. I think Ezreal can't hurt me, right? Worst case scenario, I die. Let's just do this. And I think they are gonna ward this, right? You are dead. Aha. Uh -huh. You are screwed. Let's go. That's double kill for me. You have no power here. You're just a cat. No offense to cat lovers out there. But double kill for me. Let's go. And they are pushing mid lane. Yeah, I think we just win this. It's just overall good team in general. We just win. Unless they can defend that. Even though our top lane didn't do that well, we did enough. Uh, we did enough support for the top lane to cover him, and we did pretty well in other lanes. So his um, his uh, moment of failure was actually a way for us to shine. Wow, quotable quotes right there. See, th this is why Nasus is pretty broken. See, you try to defeat Nasus in the early game, but when he goes behind in the early game you just in your head just ignore him he can't do anything but in the back line i mean in the behind the scenes uh nasus is just farming he just keeps getting stronger and stronger at the late game even though he's tanky you can't defeat him so that's why nasus is pretty old like once you reach late game nasus is almost unstoppable as a, a member of the team okay this is so bad okay Ooh. Okay, da okay, that's one bad thing about the Bolivar. His burst hurt so much. Oh wow, they hurt so much. We need a very good front line. Okay, be careful my friend, just don't die. Come on man, defend. Oh wow, we're all dying. Okay, this is bad. This is a bad sign right here. Brand, please don't die. Oh no. Okay, Brand. Okay, never mind you. At least you killed one. Oh wow, the push. Let's just back off. He freaking ulted. Let's just run away. We don't have anybody here. Ah, oh, frick. Okay. Mm-hmm. Let's just keep distracting the Yasuo. I mean, the enemy team. Let's just do that. Focus. Nice, nice, nice. We're actually winning. Nice. Now, okay, what's happening? What's happening? Are we winning? Okay, I think we're winning. NASA is just three pushing top lane. Let's go. Let's go. Irelia teleported. Let's help. Let, let me. Let us get Baron. Okay, I'm lost for words. That was such an intense battle. And I lagged in the middle of it. Uh, be careful, I don't have a smite. Nice, that was actually a nice game. I mean, nice game, nice clash right there. Okay, now we have Baron. Now let's go back. Okay, that's actually pretty good. That was a... Brand is on fire, like literally and figuratively. Like he really did well in that poke right there. Uh, 
Let's just start to push this. Free push. Now we try to... Back off. Oh no. Okay, that was bad. That was pretty bad. That was pretty bad. <laughs> I don't know what happened. She just stood there. Ah, okay, okay. Understand. She tried to do the emote. And I think this is gonna cost us a lot. Okay, she... He... And he's dead. Okay, that was pretty bad. Okay, they're up top lane. Now let's try to clear this. Let's try to get this. Just don't die, my friends. Yep. Let's actually go. Okay, they're all there. Now let's try to push this. Natsus is doing pretty well. Distracting them. Now let's try to push this lane. There's the top lane. That's nice. The scariest people are still there. Um, excuse me. That was pretty rude. Okay, this is bad. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's back off. Back off, back off. Back off. Ah, oh, frick. Mm -hmm. How are we going to win this? Oh wow, he actually hurts. Oh, a nice double you right there. Now let's back off. I think the game plan here is to let Nasus just go around and farm while we try to get objectives. Now let's try to get Baron, unless... Hmm. Can we actually do this? Okay, everything is clear. So if we really need to get a good clash. Okay, I think they're waiting for us. Kill him. Okay, now he's dying. Now let's try to do this. Die. Die. Nice. Now you die. Nice. Now you're dead. Which in turn means... Ah, screw you, man. Oh, frick. Nice. Now we get this. I think if we get this. Okay, let's just hope my smiting skill is enough. Oh, wow. That was a freaking... Oh, we aced them. Okay, now let's try to get dragon. Wait, let's back away first. Get some items. Now we get Draken. Let's try to get Dragon. We really need a Dragon. Quick Dragon. Okay, after we get this, let's try to help mid, and I think we can win. Okay. Wait, we're not there yet. Nice. Nasus is on fire. 
Ah, uh, you are screwed. Okay, we just win. Wow! That was a pretty tense game. I thought we were going to lose that. Okay. Nice game. That was so nice game. I love that. Honestly, I'm gonna honor Nasus for being tilt proof. Even though he really did not do well early, he still made it in the late game. Anyway, that was another game of League of Legends with high latency. I hope you liked the video because I really did enjoy that game. And if you did, click that like button, subscribe if you want more, and put down a comment to see what champion I'll play next. And I'll see you next time. See ya!